Hello children, welcome back to the digital class of Pramati Hilva Academy. I am Rakesh. In this session, we are going to understand about the age of social change, industrial society and the social change, how socialism entered to Europe, the rule of Tsar Nicholas II, how the Russian Revolution began. So let's get into the topic. Socialism in Europe and the Russian Revolution. History teaches us to unite ourselves to fight. If we work together, we can change the ruling system. Through the Russian Revolution to the whole world, the idea of socialism was began to spread. Even after the French Revolution, the society of Europe was not changed. A new pattern of emerged that was conservatives, liberals and radicals. The age of social change. 18th century French Revolution created a very big changes in Europe and Asian countries through the concepts of liberty, equality and fraternity. In the end of 19th century and the beginning of 20th century, the society was again divided into three categories: conservatives, liberals and radicals. Conservatives initially they don't wanted to change the system in the society, but later they understood changes to be needed but not very quickly liberals these groups people wanted to have equal respect to all the religions parliamentary government should be exist they wanted to end monarchy not believed in the voting system radicals these groups people wanted to have a new government based on majority even for the women they to have rights they ignored big land owners and factory owners also balance of private property industrial society and social change due to industrial revolution and expansion of railways in many cities were flourished along with many factories even many problems to like housing problem sanitation unemployment problem started the coming of socialism to europe by the mid 19th century people started to feel a new kind of society to be established having equal rights and opportunities the main focus of socialist leaders was to ban of private property they give impression of collective social interest to give equal opportunities the rule of tsar nicholas ii he believed in divine rights of the king so no chance for checking his powers and rights all the powers as concentrated on rich people no chance for common people russian empire included the countries like finland latvia lithuania society of russia catholics protestants muslims buddhist majority religion was russian orthodox christianity the russian revolution economy and society 85% of people are dependent on agriculture being an agricultural based country major exports of grains were the important occupation of the public st petersburg and moscow famous for industrial areas introduction of railways industries foreign investment production of coal steel iron has been increased even the working hours was too high social groups and many workers association was started in this 34% were women some of the developments in the russia before the revolution process 1898 russian social democratic workers party was started due to the influence of the great economist called karl marx 1900 socialist revolutionary party this party focused on equal wages to the peasants 1902 the situation was critical in the entire russian nation 1905 the first stroke of russian revolution after 1900 the socialist revolutionary party was divided into two political parties bolshevik party and menshevik party the spark of revolution in the year of 1904 due to the bad economy policy of tsar nicholas price has been increased and the total income of the nation decreased many people was disappointed with the way of the tsar nicholas administration the workers who are working in the st petersburg started to strike against the the ruling system of russia this protest was well supported by a person a christian father called father gepon led the protest along with 1 lakh 10000 workers when these protesters reached the russian winter palace the protest turned into a violent situation the russian soldiers started to shoot out and killed more than 100 people this was recorded in the history of russia as the bloody sunday this made tsar nicholas to start consultative parliament called as duma also he suspended liberals and revolutionaries in russian nation 
First World War and the Russian Empire started by the two alliances in Europe Central Powers and Allies Germany Austria Turkey these are the nations represented Central Powers England France Russia USA supported Allies alliance meanwhile in Russia Tsar Nicholas II started to overrule the Duma this made the establishment of anti-German sentiments in the form of changing the name of St Petersburg to Petrograd which means Tsar Nicholas I wanted to rename the city of St Petersburg to Petrograd. Russia lost to Germany and Austria during 1914 to 1916. Overall, Russia lost 7 million people in this World War 1. Also, the 3 million people became refugees. Industry started to face many problem due to the bad economic system in the Russia. Let us recall what we have learned today. We have discussed about the age of social change, socialism in Europe and Russian revolution, the age of social change, industrial society and how the society has been changed, industrial society and the social change, the coming of socialism to Europe, the rule of Tsar Nicholas II, the Russian revolution, the first world war and the Russian empire situation. In the next session we are going to understand about the February revolution in Petrograd and the October revolution in 1917 and the major changes after the October revolution in Russia the civil war making of a socialist party and the role of stalin in making russia as the modern nation so see you soon and thank you